A frightened mother watched fishes emerge in the walls of a Katmandu maternity unit and felt the earth shake underneath her feet as a colossal earthquake struck Nepal while she was in labor. Plaster at Prashuti Grai her hospital started falling from the walls and patients ran for their lives as 29-year-old Ishashrist had prepared to give birth in an operating theater. Ishas distraught relatives carried her from the room and sheltered in a tent after the powerful 7.3 magnitude quake struck killing many people and sending many dashing to the streets of the capital Kathmandu. One hour later, Asha gave birth to her daughter in an emergency room and lay down alongside with other new mothers and their newborns in a hallway. Her home was ruined less than three weeks ago when a destructive 7.8 magnitude earthquake killed over 8,000 people left hundreds of thousands homeless and flattened entire villages in the region. Dottisha's relatives were patiently waiting outside the operating theater when the ground started to shake at about 12.30 p.m. local time Tuesday. Mayhem ensued as patients started running and the medical center was evacuated. Medics waited with Asha until the ground stopped shaking before her loved ones burst into the room and carried her to the safety of an outdoor tent. She was in a lot of pain as she sat in the tent before being taken to an emergency room by medics, where she delivered a baby girl. The newborn baby girl is their third child. Their other daughters are staying in a temporary home in the ruins of their home in Swayambu. At least 37 people were killed in the earthquake. However, the toll was expected to increase as reports started reaching Kathmandu of people in remote Himalayan villages and towns being buried under debris. Lakshmi Darkal, a Nepalese government official, stated that the earthquake as well left at least 1,118 people injured after it caused buildings to collapse and triggered landslides. At least 17 people in India have passed away, Home Ministry spokesman Kuldeep Datwalaya stated taking the toll across the two countries to 55. The U.S. Geological Survey stated that the earthquake had a magnitude of 7.3 and struck in a remote conservation area 42 miles west of Namkbazar town, near Mount Everest and the border with Tibet. In other places in Kathmandu, all through the day parents could be spotted clutching kids firmly and lots of people were frantically attempting to get in touch with loved ones on their handsets. Rescue helicopters were instantly dispatched to districts northeast of the capital after the 7.3 magnitude earthquake.